Hi guys, Steve Fitzpatrick with the December 2012 typical business update. So what happened in December? Well, we created a couple of blog posts and the first one was really talking about creating a memorable brand by telling your story. And so, you know, there's a lot of businesses out there pushing their agenda, pushing their message. And for your business to become memorable, it's a lot easier if you actually uh, can sell a story that's associated with your business. And so we talk about that in one of our blog posts. We also had, or I personally had an experience where I've had to fire and hire. Um, so we created a podcast episode just on the horrible task of having to fire someone and let someone go. Now, in my years in business, I've done that for poor performance, um, misconduct, and also I've had to let people go because of uh, being made redundant. So I've shared a couple of those examples in one of our podcast episodes on firing our staff. And it should help you actually um, make it a little bit easier on yourself, but also make it easier on the person that you're having to let go. Um, that's really one of the challenges with that particular um, task that you may have. And the other thing, obviously, is when you fire people, there's opportunities quite often where you have to hire people. So we've also written a blog post you can check out on the typicalbusiness.com website on the checklist that you may want to use when you are hiring. And that should help you just work through that in a systematic way to give you a best opportunity to make sure that the person that you employ fully understands what their requirements are um, for that particular role. And it gives you a good foundation for actually getting the right person in uh, first time round and also managing that person on a continual basis going forward. Finally, we also talked about creating a ecosystem in your business. And this is something that I see regularly where businesses are just leaving money on the table. Um, they're just not generating the profits that they could generate because they haven't developed their own ecosystem. So we talk about that in the podcast and we share different ways that you can become more profitable and, um, and become more successful. So I hope that helps. That's the wrap up for December 2012. Guys, it's after Christmas now. I hope you've had a great time with your family and friends. And we're about to hit New Year's and I'm sure that a lot of you are thinking of New Year's resolutions. So well, I have an interesting podcast in mind sometime in January where we'll talk about New Year's resolutions. Um, in a little bit more detail, but probably something that I like a little bit more, which is actually goal setting and, uh, and getting things done. And, and I want to put a challenge out to you from typical business for different things that I think as business owners, we should all be taking steps towards that not only will make us more profitable and better as a business, uh, but might also be helping the environment as well. So look, it's been a great, uh, Great start to the Typical Business Podcast. I really want to thank you all for joining us in 2012 and I hope you'll be back in 2013. I'm looking forward to catching up with you then. Cheers.